What's up, y'all? Sinbaddy115, and I am back again with episode 15 of the Quad Life Discover University LP. And the last time we left off, Chris and Nick decided that they were going to take a trip over to a few of the new Sims that I placed in their world house. Um, so that is where they are right now and as you guys can see we are zoned in on Chris and Nick is over here so I'm gonna put the house down to the level that I want it to be at and we're gonna go ahead and jump into games so this house was downloaded off the gallery like I said before and there's two of them there's one here and there's one there and they're the same house it's just that um you know four people live in this one and then four people live in this one so we are gonna go ahead and figure out where the front door is <laughs> so that they can visit the sims and honestly i don't oh okay so the door is right here to the side of the house but which one of these is the front door though let's see is that the front door let's just knock on the door i think that's the front door um <clears throat> so we're gonna have chris go and knock on that door and that should open her up to all of the houses and then where the heck is Nick going okay yeah so that opened her up to all the houses so I'm just gonna pause it just so I can see who is where because I did not actually assign them you know like a specific house or anything like that so they're basically just wherever they want to be um okay this is Terry and then this is Lamont okay so Terry and Lamont is there and then we have Cassidy and Casper so I guess they chose their selective houses I'm not understanding why are they all watching the same TV show first of all look at Lamont's bed like why did he choose his bed <laughs> <laughs> and then it's like why did Cassidy choose this bed like she should have been over here and then it should have been swapped but anyways so we are gonna have um so Chachi oh, not Chachi goodness gracious I don't think about Chachi so Chris is going to go and chat it up she gonna do a friendly introduction with Terry and then um nick actually walked inside of terry house and he was not actually invited in so we're gonna have him come over here and chop it up with um lamont and let's go over here and follow chris i actually like these little apartments like this is really cute wait what's going on see what's happening what's happening girl if you don't get your butt upstairs tell me she going to see what's happening okay so the only thing i do not like about these um houses is that i see that the walls was not painted but it's cool i mean i can paint them myself and then i'm probably gonna have to update it anyways because they i guess these are the houses that they decided that they were gonna stay in so I gotta fix it up to their needs. So Chris and Terry is chatting it up. Terry got a little ball spot going on, but that's okay. We gonna act like we ain't even seen that. Um, we gonna let them watch. Wonder Woman was what um, Rush Hour was on, so we're gonna have them watch that. And then we're gonna go over to Nick. What is Nick doing? 
Oh, they walk right across. Yo, that is so cool. No, why he keep trying to be mean to her? He keep trying to taunt her about her superiority. Now, I think I said that right, y'all. Don't knock me about that. Don't knock me about that. Come tell him a funny story. Like, leave her alone. Like, he bugging. Oh, is this the game? If this the game, they could come and play the game together. Let the guys be the guys. Play trivia. Ask for a joke. What? Okay. I thought that was a, um, a game game. I guess I was wrong. Anywho, it seems like we all just kicking it over here at Terry's crib. And something is going on. <laughs> something going on with Nick because everybody keep grabbing their face and stuff. Alright, so we... Let me cut that TV off. Because it's too loud. And... Let them chat it up. Chat it up. I can't remember if Terry was supposed to be with Lamont or if she was supposed to be with Casper. Well, hold on. I know he is not flirting with him. We don't know him. No, girl. Nick is going to be so mad at you. Um. Okay, maybe they're not flirting. I hope not because Nick right there, and I know he like, what? Um, so let's tell an insider story to Terry. Nick is thinking about Chris and Lamont is thinking about Nick and Terry is mad at Lamont. Like, they already got issues. Oh, let's ask Rylan if he wants kids. Nick, do you want kids? Nick, we need to know. Because Chris want kids after school, honey. She want to get married and have children. I'm open to the idea of having kids. Oh, that is so cute. All right, so let's brighten his day. Okay, so now Terry don't like Chris. What is Terry's deal? Girl, ain't nobody want Lamont. We gonna leave him for you, honey. We is all for Nick. We just trying to be friendly with y'all or whatever so that we can all be friends because we might end up running in the same circle soon or later but I guess she was like you came over here to talk to your man girl you could go talk to him somewhere else y'all they don't like us what is they do <laughs> what is the issue alright so we probably just going to go home because they, they're they being really funky with us. And I don't like that. Where's Nick going? In a minute, I'm about to go talk to uh, Cassidy because I feel like Cassidy might be a little more chill. He about to go to the bathroom. Who bathroom are you about to go to, though? He's just walking out, leaving me here with these heifers. What is that for in this man? Okay, let's... Uh-uh, because see, she looked like she with it. So let me go over here. Um, Let's do a funny introduction. Let's crack a joke with little Miss Mimi right now. Little Cassie. Everybody is like walking out the house. What is going on? Why Casper over... <laughs> Casper went to Lamar house to eat. Cassidy went to Casper house like y'all they all over the place I should have just assigned them their own house I might do that I might assign them their own house off a uh, game girl what's your issue like you gonna walk all the way over here just today you gonna talk about my man girl bye girl boy and then now you got Cassidy in it too I just sent you some money Make sure you use it wisely. Uh-uh, you're sending me some money. Uh-uh, what's going on? I'm about to accept it, too, because we don't deny no money around here. <laughs> These son is 
37 funky dollars. I'm like, <laughs> I'm at Simoleon's. Like, what's this deal? Oh, no, sir. We not even about to play. Tell outrageous story. I think we just, oh, nobody like, <laughs> we all got an issue with Cassie that. Everybody like, uh, oh, Cassie girl, listen, you got that ADHD, so we just, we just acted funny for some reason. I'm not understanding. Like, I don't get it. Like, everybody has a weird trait, though. So why are they just, like, picking and choosing who they want to be nasty with? We're all friends here. We love each other. Let's share the love. Oh, look at Casper. Where is Nick? Y'all, Chachi and Ni is solo. Nick over here eating out the people food and he's tired. Let me see. Like, I'm not even about to play with him. I don't want to send him home and then I'm by myself. Then he already left me over here by myself. What's going on? Chat with Cass. I about to say I thought we was having an issue for a second. I'm talking about y'all. They is chilling. Y'all, Terry look real thugged out. Like <laughs> her winter outfit is very gangsta. I was going to be nice and clean up their little kitchen stuff. But I was like, no, you know what? I'm not even going to try it. Okay, so. Since Nick is tired. We're just going to go ahead and just go to the crib. Because we don't had enough fun. We had a, enough love fun. So. He like, come on. Come on, Chris. Let's go. We ain't got time to keep uh sitting over here chatting it up. Let's go. All right. So we are back home, and y'all, yes, I still have yet to change Chachi's clothes, but it's cool. It's all good. So, Nick is about to go to bed. Our needs are pretty high, so we're actually good. We don't even have to go to sleep, okay? But we are going to check in on Chachi and D because I know I miss them. Like, <laughs> we done been dealing with the other crew and they issues. Yo, what the world is going on with baby girl? Got the hands on the knees. I'm not understand that. I don't think that that's okay. <laughs> I don't think she's supposed to be like that. All right, so let's see what's up with D. He's hungry. Um, <clears throat> I'm gonna open up. I'm gonna open up the door to Chachi's crib. Wait, whoa, what's going on? Unlock for specific sim for D. So we're gonna unlock for D, and then we're gonna unlock D's house for Chachi. All right, cool. So we are gonna send Chachi over to D's house to cook. Wait, is that hamburger? Oh, it's not even spoiled. Oh, so he good. He could come downstairs. I was about to have her do her little thing in the kitchen for him, even though she burnt the house down almost the first time. But we ain't going to speak on that no longer. <laughs> so we just going to have him come eat this hamburger. And we are going to have her go to bed because her um, sleep knee is about to drop drastically. Okay, look at him listening to reggae sound like. Who listening to that? Which one of them is listening to that? Must be Nick. Oh no, that's Chris. Let me see. No, not Chris. 
sword, then that means it's definitely Nick. Even though he's asleep. He's asleep, right? No, he not asleep. He taking a darn nap. Like, somebody told him to do that. I said go to sleep. Um, Chachi is asleep. Z is awake. He eating. And now he's gonna also have to go to sleep. Like, my sims are the most sleepiest sims ever. Wait, where did he go? Y'all, he done went inside. Boy, go home. She is sleeping. He was like, oh, I done got a key to the house. So let me go over and walk to her crib real quick. No. Uh-uh. That's sad. It's time to go to bed. It's time to go to bed, buddy. Alright, so... I'm so sick of this tree. I'm about to delete this darn tree because I'm not understanding. I'm not understanding. Alright, so we're about to have Chris do laundry. I think y'all have been adding so many things to the washing machine that I have yet to add anything to the dryer, y'all. I'm just being honest. Like, repair? Huh? Y'all, she done broke her dang on laundry. She broke it. What? How did it break? Girl, whoa. we can't even replace it. It won't even allow us to replace it. We got to repair it. <laughs> Where's Nick when we need him? What if she get electrocuted? I can't deal. No. I can't take it. Well, first of all, let me go ahead and delete this tree because I'm getting tired of this tree, y'all. <laughs> like this tree is pissing me off and the way for no reason this one and this one got to go bye bye okay so there's that comes with this laundry girl I meant repair <laughs> hopefully she can repair and then if there is some clothes in the washing machine she could put them in the dryer and then she could go ahead and wash those other clothes um monday is vastly approaching and they all have class except for chachi of course but everybody else have class and since they're gonna go to class i'm gonna have them do uh whatever little assignments like uh she has this poster board or whatever that she gotta do okay but it was already broken so she should have fixed it right is something else broken Y'all, I'm so shocked at the fact that D only has, I believe this is a washing machine. And that has to be repaired too. Oh no, okay, so it just must be the one that's over here. And it's probably, is it going to repair all of them? Y'all, why are all of them broken? Is it because it's raining and they're outside in the dang on rain? If so, like really? Come on now. What was the point of putting them out there? I did not put them out there. Anyways, so my girl Chris is getting hungry, so we're going to have to feed her. And we're going to let her eat some food. Hopefully, repairing this one repairs all of them. Because we can't be dealing with broken um, laundry uh, machines. I wonder if it's broken because I kept sending them to do laundry and... They never really actually took the washed clothes and put them in the dryer. But anyways, so I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to end this video right here because it seems like it is starting to have a little issue with her and the repair. So I want you guys to, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. And as always... Happy swimming. Bye, y'all.